Hello and welcome to this vlog of Forum 2022. I thought it would be a good idea to start the vlog now before things get rolling to give you a proper introduction of what on earth this vlog is going to be about but let me start by saying that if you are new to my channel hi my name is Lydia I am a 21 year old student who studies in Manchester in the United Kingdom and yeah as the title and introduction suggests this is going to be a vlog of Forum 2022 for those of you who are asking I can hear you asking what is Forum? Forum is a Christian conference aimed at students run by UCCF for uni students, the Christian Union members, committees, there's seminars, socials, events. It's like about equipping and training and spreading the gospel of Jesus Christ, basically. I'm not just going to Forum, I'm actually volunteering at Forum, but hopefully if you're considering being a volunteer or just considering going, you know, if you are either of those options, hopefully this vlog will still provide a bit of an insight into what it's like. It is currently Friday, the 26th of August. Most people, students, attendees of Forum actually are gonna be arriving on Tuesday in Shropshire at Quinta, which is where Forum is held. But like I mentioned, I am volunteering and so I am required to be there from tomorrow which is Saturday so I thought I'd start the vlog now it's going to be a slightly longer vlog than some other people's experiences of forum because of the fact I'm a volunteer but yeah I'm just so excited tonight Ruby will be joining me on the vlog before she arrives a very quick rundown of who Ruby is Ruby contacted me after seeing my social media I think it was my TikTok we got speaking on the phone and very quickly realized we're basically the same person but we've never actually met in person. <laughs> so you are gonna see that happening for the first time. Without further ado, welcome to the vlog. I'm so excited, I've had a reminder in my phone for months to vlog this trip. Welcome to the vlog. I hope you enjoy it. Ruby's here. Hello. I'm just here with my bestie. Yeah, my life is very much taken to Ruby. Hey vlog, it's the morning of forum travel day. We've left Ruby getting ready. We got fruit pastels, more sweet flour, wow. and we're going to get eggs because we're making pancakes. And I'll show you them because aren't I an expert at pancakes? Actually I'm. Pancake making has commenced and this one is really good. Let me. Oh yeah, she's a pro. Here's the luggage. Most of it is mine. <laughs> every, in every single one of your vlogs, there's always a clip of me just looking really awkward in the back seat. <laughs> Welcome to Forum! Oh, so it's actually a proper conference centre that's just a Christian conference centre. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh, that's me. <laughs> looks so good. <laughs> We're just trying to find someone because it's like, it's huge, isn't it? Yeah, and, and quite empty. <laughs> quite empty. We have no idea what we're doing. <laughs> but hopefully in the next clip, we'll be set up and ready to go. It's so, so wide and wide. It does kind of feel like we've known each other. Oh, that's awful lighting. <laughs> Hi, vlog. Seeing all the tents being set up has made me excited to show you guys when people are here. So yeah. I think it will be better when people are actually here, because at the moment, there's not many people. Yeah, and there's so like 10 just, of us. There's not much to do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but we're getting to know everyone. We had lasagna. Did you cook the lasagna? Ruby's on hospitality. No, Did you cook it? No, we just served to people. Served it. So, let's... I would not be trusted with cooking. <laughs> Here's our evening attire for a night on the town. Wow, well, that's a good lighting. <laughs> hey, vlog. It's first night and we are going to play games with everyone <laughs> don't know if anyone can see us no you literally like, can't you can just see the silhouettes yeah we're in the games room <laughs> we're just playing um ping pong or table tennis table yeah. tennis hi vlog it's day two i've set up and today oh i didn't show you my high vis and my lanyard but today we're hammering flags into the ground it's 9am and it's a scorcher. It's going to be warm today, so if you see me with a tan, that is why. <laughs> wow. 
Hey vlog, I'm currently sat under a tree in this little woodland. It's very cute. It is 3 p.m. on Sunday and I just felt the need to update you and fill you in on the events of this morning. It's probably not what you'll expect to hear, but setup was going great, it was going amazing, and all of a sudden I just began to feel like super overwhelmed. And I think the fatigue and the excitement and the anticipation and everything basically just started hitting me at once. And yeah, I just began not feeling very well. And in that moment, I really felt challenged because the old Lydia, before she was made new in Christ, she just wanted to appear like she was so strong and she just wanted to, um, she wanted people to think she had it all together and she was so afraid of being vulnerable. But this morning I felt challenged by God in that moment to really share what I was feeling and to basically show my weakness to the team whom I've only known for under 24 hours. So I was really honest about how I was feeling and being vulnerable, so much good has come out of it. And it's literally 3 p.m. Like it only happened a few hours ago. So I just wanted to really share that and encourage people. Romans 8, 28 says that God works all things for good. And it's literally a few hours later and I'm already seeing how that has come to fruition, the truth of God's word. Because I was vulnerable and showed my weakness and told everyone how I was feeling, um, relationships have been strengthened, bonds have been strengthened and made that weren't there before. I'm just here sat in this woodland feeling very grateful to be in this beautiful location. Jesus is still king. He's always king. He is the perfect one. He is the strong one. We are humans. We are weak and often like today, we are just so reminded of our humanity and our weakness. And there's nothing to be ashamed of in that because in the Bible, it says that his power is made perfect in our weakness. This is the current, current view, which is pretty cool. Sort of 10, oh yeah, it's chocolate orange. We're just heading down to the main arena to do a few bits of like evening setup for literally like 45 minutes and then the night is ours. So I'll touch you soon. Hey vlog. Hello. <laughs> this is Abigail and we're best friends. Wow. And oh, <laughs> and she's leaving on Wednesday, so I thought we'd get some quality vlog content of us eating jacket and Not the king <laughs> Thinking about why did I stop vlogging now because there's nothing to vlog but Sam. So <laughs> Sam just dug in to a delicious film. plate of cling film. Um, <laughs> Hi vlog, we've just come out from lunch. This is James and Sam, you met Sam before. And James just told us a very long, but actually not disappointing joke about monks and a secret room. So hit him up and ask him to tell you the joke because it was actually quite funny. <laughs> We're going to set up chairs. Yeah. So I won't take you with me because we're just setting up chairs. So, yeah, bye. It's still Monday. It literally feels like I've been here my whole entire life, which is amazing. But I just wanted to hop on the vlog to literally tell you about the sheer goodness of God. Like, I literally can't put it into words. So, well, I'm, I am about to put, it, to put it into words. But anyway, you saw the clip yesterday of me talking about it being a bit of a rough day. I woke up very apprehensive and nervous for today. But at breakfast, Abigail, who is the girl that you saw on the previous clip or a couple of clips back, she basically is my forum bestie. That's the name that we have coined. You know people who you meet and you just click with. We did testimonies, we did everything. I know she's watching this video, but I'm just fangirling about her because I just feel like it was a God moment that we became friends anyway. This morning at breakfast, she gave me a word. She said, Lydia, I was praying for you when I was Bible studying, which in itself is beautiful. And she said, God put these verses on my heart and proceeded to share some of Ephesians and um, the passage about the armor of God. And when we were speaking and praying, just the word that she shared with me encouraged me so much that today has ended up being an incredible testimony and turning point. So we're about to go to dinner. I feel like someone is about to come into the room. We're about to head to dinner, but I just wanted to share that with you because, hi.
is Ruby and vlogging. Oh my god. I was goodness. like, I feel like someone's coming back into the room. Should I come and say hi? Yes. Hi. Having a barbecue. Oh yeah, we're having a barbecue. I'll do a clip of that. Here is dinner. Yeah. Wow. I am not doing that. Hey guys. James has got a YouTube channel. <laughs> Sam House of Food. Exceptionally normal. <laughs> <laughs> and we got a great view. Uh, <laughs> wow. We had the most delicious pulled pork I have ever had in my whole entire life. And that was no exaggeration. You saw it on the video. And I'm just heading down to the game room. We're going to play some games. Have you got one more player? One more? No! <laughs> no, I'm watching it. Like, it's too early to embarrass myself. I mean, I hit it and I just. It, it was. <laughs> yeah. yes. Are you gonna do it? Never mind. I'm so bad. And that's five match points. You smash it now. Ten five match points. You should. I just want to win. No, no, no. Go away! Yes! Hey, you won! Yeah! <laughs> hey guys, so we're just playing some games and it's the last night of peace before the students descend so we're just looking at the fairy lights, very pretty. You cannot see me, you can see the pretty fairy lights. Well, that's the last day of setup done. Tomorrow a thousand, well 1.4 thousand students descend on this beautiful place and so I'll check in with you tomorrow. Good night and God bless. Good morning beautiful people. I'm just on a job putting up a few final signs. It's the day of arrival. All the students are arriving today and I needed to just tell you about this morning because it was unreal and I'm so glad I didn't vlog it because it was just me and God. But I woke up at half past six and I just thought, right, I can't get back to sleep. What do I do with myself? So I got out of bed and I went for a walk and I came across this bench that's like overlooking the whole site. And I just sat there and I had taken my Bible with me. And because it was so early in the morning, it was so quiet. It was so quiet. And especially knowing that all of the students are arriving today, I just thought to myself, this is like the last few moments that it's gonna be like this. So I have my Bible and the Lord spoke to me through the scriptures in an amazing way. Me and Abby were speaking about this, how you can read a passage so many times. And then one day, it just takes on a whole new meaning like that's the Lord that's his spirit that's his word is alive his word is it's God breathed the Bible is and it was just so incredible and it was so quiet and the sun was coming up and I'm in nature outside and I was praying to God and it was just a very surreal moment and I'm so glad I didn't vlog it because it was just me and God but yes I better get on because like I said everyone is arriving soon but I'm so excited for today literally so excited so yeah I'll fill you in later but we're just here doing some very official stuff with a cup of tea. And can say hi. Hey. Hello. Hey. <laughs> the girls' table. We're just having a relax and appreciating the peace, the calm before the storm, but it's gonna be a good storm. Happy storm. So this is what the site looks like right now. There's a crepery. What? There's a crepery. That's what it is. Because mm -hmm. I was wondering what the little house was. It's so cute, isn't it? Wow. So yeah, there you have it guys. Still have a sandwich there. <laughs> There's still a sandwich. Yeah, but I can't just fill my sandwich. I we had cute little paper bag lunches on this hill that I forgot to vlog. Here's Sam again. Sorry Sam, you're just I'm just pointing the camera at you. Um and here is well I don't really know. Princess. Everything. So I I wasn't surprised that I was expecting that, but then my, like, I feel like I should be doing something. I feel like that's what I'm like as a person, but also because we've been so busy. I'm just lying here. I'm like, maybe I should be doing something when I literally have nothing on my rota until nine o'clock, which is when the stage that I'm managing opens. And then I'm going from nine till 11 p.m. Why don't you get a trolley? <laughs> I'm vlogging again. Hi vlog. <laughs> She's got the milk. 
I've got she's the got, milk. She's got the milk. Ruby's just delivering some milk. It's three o'clock and the move-in times for the students is three till six. So literally any moment now, 1,400 students. I don't know if you noticed, but I changed the colour of my vest. My role as venue manager begins today. So that is why I have changed colours. And I also have a radio. Oh no, thank you. That's very kind. <laughs> Actually, we're vlogging. Huh? We're vlogging. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello. Um, lovely to be here at um, Forum this week. Yes, oh, is it that is. Food? Walkie talkies. Yeah, very official. These girls are very powerful. They've got yes. walkie talkies in their hands. Yes. They can catalyze a million and one different responsibilities just at the sheer word. Through That's us. That is us um, defined. So, great. Um, shout out to all of um, uh, Kelly XOXO's viewers. It's really great to be here with you this week. Take care. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I'm so glad I started filming. Hi, James. Hey guys, we've just Hello. had delicious spaghetti bolognese for dinner, and I'm with James and Ellie. And what are we doing? We are walking down to the <laughs> steward. <laughs> there we go to do our job. And on that note, <laughs> hey guys, Katie and Anisha and Ruby and Abby, and we're going into. I need to take this off because I'm not in shift. We're going into the first main meeting. And it's going to be so good, and I'm going to vlog it, and it's probably going to be the first vlog content of Forum. Yeah. So, yes! We're at our first main meeting. I'm only here for half an hour, and then I've got to go. But we're so excited. I'll show you around. After the storm, we are finished. Golden hour vibes. <laughs> Day two? No, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, four. Day four, but <laughs> technically day two of four room. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Woo! Is that porridge? I think so. And muffin. I need to sit oh. around this side. I'm sorry, but I've just come back in to get a jacket before I start my day. And I just feel like I look really funny. <laughs> I have found a slice of heaven. We're at the bookshop. No, because I swore that I wouldn't spend any more money this summer and then and they're all really cheap. And like there's some books here that I've been wanting to read for like months and I just know. I'm gonna go home with a stack of new books. I can't, can't cope. This is, this is too tempting, guys. I will buy this whole bookshop. 
I couldn't resist and I bought this to read while I'm on shift. Hey with Anissa! You Hi haven't guys. been on the vlog yet. Do you I want to show it. them your earrings? Oh wait, okay. So we've got light blue gummy, gummy bear, bear earrings. Every day Anissa has had like the nicest earrings as people coming in. But we're just about to start another event and it's going well. So. Concentrate on one of them. Okay. The vlog, his dinner. His James's dinner. His James. <laughs> Here's the view. And. <laughs> Why am I in your vlog again? <laughs> Main meeting time. What, my view doesn't have pose. <laughs> I am so pumped and ready to go. I'm literally so excited. I'm feeling amazing. I've taken my makeup off and my hair's like in a little slip up pony and we're ready to go and host this event and I'm excited. I love rap music. I love Christian rap music. My pockets as per are literally filled with snacks. We were saying at lunch today, not at lunch, at tea, at dinner, how none of us have ever eaten as much as like on this camp and it's just because we're constantly on the go. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited. Ready? All the crap and fleet and sledges that kept leading astray, all distortions of the truth that for a short time amaze, but still leave you hollow without Jesus' name. <laughs> How unreal is this? Listen. Oh my gosh. So I was just helping on Q Control at the main stage and I've just come down to my favorite spot in the hill with my Bible to just have a bit of a read, a bit of a rest, a bit of a refresh. Um, I'm finding it so like, oh my gosh, guys, how unreal that you can hear the worship from here. Wow. Taste of heaven. Hello. I had a lovely little morning nap and now I've just changed into these trousers because it's quite cold today. I'm just going down to fringe stage for the first event of the day. So I want to think for a minute, how does Jesus empower mission? Massive shocker, I've been to the bookshop again. This first one, my roommate Frankie recommended, is called Seven Myths About Singleness. And then I got this, The Pilgrim's Progress, because it's like a crazy famous Christian book. And I also got this, The Hiding Place, Ari Ten Boom's testimony um, about the Holocaust, basically. So I got those three, and this was recommended by Abby. So thanks to my new Christian friends, he recommended more, more good books. And I'm going back after this event to buy a few more. I'm so excited and I'm also not sad that I'm spending all my money on books. Um, how do you think these kinds of things can help us in our studies, um, particularly when we're talking to Paul's face? The high vis is back on, the radio is back on, the lanyard's back on, the earpiece will be back on and she's back on duty. It's time for evening event number three. I didn't vlog it but I had the most amazing dinner. It was it was so good. Me and two of the guys, Abraham and Sam, shout out if you're watching, had just like a, such a deep conversation. And I love having deep conversations with other Christians. So shout out to them. And yes, tonight is gonna be a good one and a busy one. I'm all showered, making the most of the quiet showers while everyone's at the main meeting. And I'm gonna go and eat a muffin and a tangerine and get some sugar in me before tonight. And yes, I will see you on the vlog clip because I am definitely going to vlog tonight. So God is so good. Amen. Goodbye.
show you what I bought this morning. They're by the same woman, Emma Scrivener. I think that's how you say it. This one's called A New Name. And this one is called A New Day. And they're her testimonies and experiences about eating disorders and anxiety and that you know I have had experience with. So I'm really excited to see how the Lord will move in my life through these books. And I'm actually gonna go and start reading one now. So I've got like an hour until my shift begins. By the way, it's the last official day of forum. What would be my first step? So that's a really encouraging thing to do. Who are you going to go and talk to? Usually it's somebody who looks friendly, but often... Lunchtime! On the job. Night at Quinta. Mm. Silent disco time. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks. <laughs> it looks so cool. <laughs> at the silent disco. Ooh, go so he had his headphones on. The Day's dream. I felt it in my <laughs> Part two of Anissa's amazing earrings. Lasto. Are they like ice lattes? It's like boba tea. <gasps> yeah, milk tea, boba tea. So I'm so sad, but I'm happy, but I'm sad. And we're packing down, guys, yeah. after the main meeting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 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 Um, I'm going to get you some blue roll. Blue roll? Oh, blue roll. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Quite like, exactly. Oh, is it your blue roll? I'm going to get some of That is a brilliant idea. Are we going for lunch? Lunch vibes. Oh, I just filmed Dan by accident. What's going on? Well, guys, the site is packed up and we're all heading home. I'm just going to pack my things. That is the end of Forum 2022. It's been probably one of the most challenging weeks of my life, but also the best week of my life. I've met people who I'm going to be friends with for my whole life. We feel like a little family, we've, we've all bonded so much. And I'm just so grateful to God for the experience. I'm so grateful for the courage to come and for what he's taught me and for his goodness. That's the end of the vlog. Thank you for watching. By God's grace, there'll be another vlog this time next year because I'm up for it. So without further ado, this has been the Forum 2022 vlog. My first forum, not my last forum, by God's grace. And thank you so much for watching. Goodbye and God bless.